This is a little bit of a different Wendy Darling Wednesday. Hello, my darlings. It is my birthday, and we just went and had Indian food. Oh, so good. We are in at home inside the mall. There is an at home inside the mall here. So, and then we're gonna hit Sephora because you get a free item for our Sephora. And then I think we're gonna go. I don't know what we're gonna do, what we're gonna get into. But it's my birthday and I'm hoping to do a mukbang tonight with Chinese food, but I ate so much at this Indian food buffet that I'm like, I don't think that's gonna happen. <laughs> so I may or may not do that tonight, but my hair kind of cooperated today. It's looking kind of cute. I don't really feel like doing makeup. I mean, I was gonna, and then I was like, this place closes at 2.30, I really wanna eat there, so. I had to hurry up and so I just did my brails and got lashes on I'm wearing my bats I always wear black but anyway there's my honey <laughs> he had to pee so we are out of the house <laughs> so I don't know what we're gonna get into but we're gonna look around here and then I'm gonna go get my stuff from Sephora and check out Hot Topic and <laughs> creeper alert. Want. Want. <laughs> How much is it, babe? Turn that tag around. I'm afraid. $279.99. You know, that's not that bad. It's just a bunch of drawers. Yep. I like it. This is the most accurate hand towel ever. <laughs> Accurate. Hey my darlings, welcome back to my channel. It is Wendy Darling Wednesday and it's a special one because it's my birthday. So, we went to India Delight, which is a vegetarian, well actually I thought it was vegetarian. It's like half vegetarian and then half like, it had like chicken and Liam. I had so much good food. I normally, okay, when I, when I lived in Texas, I used to eat like copious amounts of Indian food. Like they had, we had a place like right there. I mean, it was so good and it was a buffet and for lunch, like I would go like pig out. Like I'm not even gonna lie, like three plates pig out, okay? So today I'm thinking it's gonna be kind of the same situation. Like I haven't had Indian food in a while. I haven't had a buffet. I barely made it, I didn't even, my second plate, like, I felt so bad, and, like, I don't like leaving food, because if you get a plate, like, you get what you can eat, you know, so, I ate my first plate, like, I inhaled my first plate, and went back for the second plate, like, alright, let's do this, you know, it's my birthday, I'm gonna eat Indian food, I'm so happy. Okay, I did not finish that plate, like, I felt bad, I mean, I ate, like, the majority of the plate, but, so I had the palak paneer. The only dairy in the palak paneer is actually the paneer, which is the cheese. So I just got the spinach stuff. There's no cream in it. There's nothing like that. So it's just the paneer. Um, so I just got the spinach part of it. I got the rice. I got, um, I think it's called, I don't know. It's like cabbage and peas. Really good. And then they had a um, soy and potato. So they had like little soy meatballs with potatoes. Oh man, that was really good. And then they had vegetable korma, which is my favorite. And what else did they have? Uh, oh, samosas, which they were okay. Um, the samosas, like, where the dough and the filling met, it was like they weren't fried enough. Like, they needed to be deep fried a little bit longer because it was kind of gummy. So that was my only thing I didn't like about it. And then they had, like, vegetable pakora. Those are bomb. Those were so good. Um, and it was relatively inexpensive for us, for both of us to go eat for lunch. Um, well, from what I'm used to. I don't have coffee today, but McAllister's Deli Sweet Tea. Their sweet tea, is, their sweet tea, their sweet tea is really, really good. Um, because we ended up going to the mall afterwards, so I could get my free stuff from Sephora. And that wasn't the only place that I went to. So we went to At Home. This is my favorite thing I found, and it was on clearance. And I'm surprised I found the one Halloween thing. Of course I would. I'd turn back if I were you. I love it. 
Isn't it cute? And on the sides and the top, it's got like glitter chevron print. And it was on the clearance. So it was original price. Can y'all even see? Yeah. It was original price $7.99. It was 50% off, or so we thought. Do you know how much we pay for this? 79 cents. That's what I'm talking about. 79 cents. Got me a little wooden plaque. I'd turn back if I were you. Halloween bats. I love it. Happy birthday to me. So, that's all we got from at home. I mean, they have a lot, a lot, a lot of stuff that I want there. It's not right now what we need. Oh, hi, Miss Bailey. So, my next destination, hot topic, because for your birthday, you get $5 off whatever you spend. So I was like, sure, I can find something. I'm sure I can find something. I used to work for Hot Topic. I love Hot Topic. It's a, it's a part of like my youth. <laughs> and uh, but this one was really tiny. Like I was surprised to see a Hot Topic in this mall anyway, but it was super, super tiny. So um, they really didn't have a whole, whole lot. They did have a lot of Funko Pop characters for surprisingly such a small store. From Hot Topic, I just got some jewelry because they had, was it buy two, get two free? So I thought, okay, why not? So I ended up picking up, since I'm an Aries, I got these little guys. Can you even focus on that? So I got the little Ram symbol. I got Rams. And then I think this is the, yeah, the constellation. I got these for my second hole because I wear, usually I'll wear dangles in my second hole, but sometimes I like, you know, I like studs. So I got those. And then I got these really cute earrings. I think they're super cute. In fact, I want to try them on right now because why not? It's my birthday and I'll do what I want. It's my birthday and I think I just dropped something. Oh, I dropped the little... I dropped the little plastic piece, like, okay, they, it comes with that little plastic piece covering, and then it has this thing, which you're supposed to pop off the plastic, but anyway, let's just take out my stars. That's cool. I like them a lot. Super cool. All right, so I'll find that later. I'm sure it's a part of my rug now. Anyway, so check those babies out. Just little crystal dangles. I don't even know if it's real crystal or if it's like a real stone or whatever. It just says ER pure crystal glitter dangles. I don't know. I'll have to look up and see. I don't remember which stone it reminds me of, but pretty crystal dangles oh yes and they catch the light so pretty like my doll black craft cult little kitty ring is it a kitty okay. so here's the ring that's a little kitty 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 a little black kitty and it's pretty tiny, so I doubt it'll fit on anything but my pinky. It's just a kitty. It's a kitty. But, like, I would wear it probably, I don't know. I mean, I don't know. How are you supposed to, or is it this way? Does it go this way? Are you supposed to wear it like that? I don't know. I don't know. I just thought it was cute. Alright, so that is all I got from Hot Topic. And I got $5 off of that. And so I needed to go into um, Sephora to get my furry item. And I have misplaced, lost, the dog destroyed, and I can't find the remnants. I don't know what happened to it, but I have lost my beauty blender. I needed a new one, so dash what I got. I got my a brand new beauty blender. This is the original one, except for it says beauty queen on it. I've never seen it look like this, but it says the original beauty blender on it, so. If you have never used one of these, they are amazing balls. So, go get you one. And my free item, woohoo! From Bite Beauty this month, you get, looks like a lip crayon, a lipstick, and a lip gloss, maybe? Let's see, pucker up, it's your birthday. 
And this is for all April birthdays. So if you have a birthday in April, you go check it out and go get you a um, little free thing from Sephora. I'm pretty sure their stuff is cruelty free. That's why I still own one of their um, lipsticks, like two of their lipsticks actually. So it looks like I got this color in Glace or Glace. I don't know. There's no accent over the E, so it's probably Glace. Anyway, looks like a lip crayon. Looks like that. It's very similar to my natural color, but my lips have actually faded um, from when I was younger. They used to be really dark. Oh, and the cutest little lipstick. Oh my goodness. Oh, how cute is that? <laughs> it's so tiny. Okay, and the color is, ooh, that's pretty. And it is also, it is called Chai, which is perfect. <laughs> I film in my window. You guys know this. My husband and Luna are outside playing right here, and I did not realize he was going to sneak up on me. I love you. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> are you trying to kill me, honey? You let me at least make it to 40? <sighs> yeah, it's my 39th birthday, by the way. Happy birthday to me. So, I'm going to try this on since I don't have uh, anything on my lips right now. I think I might put the chai on the bottom lip and the other one on the top lip. Well, let's just do it since we're, we're here. All right, it's so cute and tiny. All right, let's do this. Ooh, it smells good. I like lipsticks that smell good. I like any lip products that smell good. If they smell like plasticky chemicals, uh-uh, you're done with that. Again, looks very similar to my natural lip color when my lips are like normal. All right, let's go with this lip crayon on the top. Husband. I see you, Sanford. <laughs> I like the top color better. It's less um, like orangey browny color. Anyway, so that along with a little, looks like a lip gloss sample. Okay, that looks scary. What is that? Oh, very cool. It's agave sugar lip scrub and agave lip balm. So when I pulled this out, I look at this one, I'm like, mm, what is that? So yeah, that's pretty cool. So I have a lip balm and a lip, I'm not gonna open that. So I wanna rub these two together. Yeah, it's a doable color. I mean, I can I can hang with that. Either one of them. I just think they look better together actually. All right, so that is what you get in this month's birthday present from Sephora. So thank you Sephora for my birthday present. The Sephora that we have is inside JCPenney. So she was like, do you have a JCPenney card? I'm like, no. No store cards for me, thank you. So she's like, well, um, you know, if you apply, you can get all this stuff. We have like a whole bunch of stuff that we can give you. And I was like, go on. And uh, she's like, it doesn't matter if you just, you know, if you just apply, it'll, you can get the free stuff anyway. I was like, okay, thank you, I'll do that. So I ended up getting five little items just for applying. So first up, we have Sephora Lash Craft big volume mascara. I needed a new mini. I really like the minis and so I'm gonna go through and find out which ones of these are cruelty free and vegan and if they aren't then I'll just find a home for them or I'll do a giveaway or something. I don't know. You guys would be interested in a giveaway? So um, anyway Sephora Lashcraft big volume mascara. Got the oh yes I've been wanting to try this. Alex learning to be fearless raves about this way hair oil. It's rose hair and body oil. I don't know if this is the one that she, this is the particular one that she raves about, but I've been wanting to try it since she started talking about it. It's by the company called Way. I don't know anything about the company as far as being like cruelty free or vegan or anything like that. So I'm going to have to check it out. Next up, we've got Rich Kid Coconut Oil Gel by IGK. 
Maybe that's what I'm smelling. No, this is something totally different. Oh man, this smells really good. <sighs> okay, that's the thumbnail. <laughs> that smells really good. Paraben and sulfate free, petroleum and mineral oil free, cruelty and gluten free and vegan. Yay! All right, this is definitely a key. Protini Polypeptide Cream by Drunk Elephant. By Drunk Elephant. I like the name. So it's a facial moisturizer. And last but not least, I got a highliner matte gel eye crayon from Marc Jacobs in number 41, Earthquake. And Earth is in parentheses, so. But here's the color. It just looks like a brown. Yep, it's a brown. And I have a black one, and I think I kept it because it is cruelty free. So now I have a brown gel eyeliner. And I use my black one a lot, so I already have one of these. So I know how they perform, and I really like them. So yay! Thank you, JCPenney and Sephora, for that, because it's all free. So yeah. And my dad sent me a card with some dinero. My mom sent me some ca a card with some dinero. So we got to go eat and I got to pick up a couple of beauty items that I wanted to do. So thank you. And um, yeah, I've had a great birthday so far. Oh, I just got out of the bath. I was taking a nice little bubble bath before I went to bed. And I just got out of the bath. 12.08 AM, I get an email from a company called Lookvine. And really and truly at the end of March I got this you got an email from them and they were saying hey we're interested we like your um, your Instagram profile we want to interview you so you know here's the questions and please send us five photos and I'm like okay sure let's do this well I didn't have five photos that I wanted to send so I took some new pitches but yeah I'll link that below I'll link it on the screen I was excited they featured me in an article uh, so I thought that was pretty cool and yeah, they just ask you a bunch of questions. You fill out the questions, you send them the pictures, and then they pick if they, you know, they pick their pick the ones that they want to use for whichever article they're using. And I I'd never heard of Look Fine before. I think it's a it's a fashion and beauty blog, and I think it's really cool to be featured on there because you know I mean I, I think it's really cool to be featured on there. And yeah, so they asked me some questions about makeup, and like one of the questions, or actually a couple questions, were about makeup. And yeah, it was just, it was neat. And then, uh, so I'm featured with a bunch of other different Instagrammers. And yeah, so that happened on my birthday. I'm glad that the article came out on my birthday. I thought that it was going to come out later on. I didn't even know if they were going to pick me or use me. And uh, so they did. And yay. So I'm going to post it on all my social media, of course. And uh, yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know. Well, I mentioned that I wanted to do a Chinese food mukbang tonight for dinner but I'm still full from Indian food and we ate there at 1 30 it is now I don't even know what time it is it's late it's like six something at night uh, but yeah that's how my birthday went and I am having a great birthday and yeah did I mention it's my birthday <laughs> it's like brows today they turned out good not every day I have good brows <laughs> especially when I do makeup it's like and I did this in like five minutes I was like okay I need to put on something and I don't even have foundation on today I didn't care I was just like I just want Indian food because they closed at 2 30 and I was like we gotta go we gotta go so and that's a like 30 minute drive and I had to get gas and it was just like it was an adventure already really not a whole lot to talk about on, on this Monday Darling Wednesday because it's my birthday we had a downpour last night it really came down and it was just I slept so good my back didn't hurt I just I had a bubble bath and I went straight to bed I was like trying to watch some YouTube videos I think I got like two in before I was just snoring and yeah so anyway guys I hope you're doing well and I will catch you on the next one thank you for listening and bye